Okay, there's this thing, there's this viral thing that's been going around Facebook lately. It's all about these groups of underage students who weren't allowed to join their graduation rights for posting bikini photos all over Facebook. See, remember the time when the problems didn't come from Facebook? Remember that? Yeah. yeah. Good times, good, good times. times. Friends there, yeah. I myself got caught by my school for posting lewd pictures of my braid <laughs> all over Facebook. Take that, old school. I'm kidding, I love San Carlos. Hi, San Carlos. Look at me now, I'm successful. David, though. We're poor. I feel for the students, I really do. I know how it feels for not to be able to go to their graduation rights. Know how it feels to not. It's like baking a cake, being promised to eat said cake that you bake, and at the end of it all, you realize that the cake is a lie. The cake is a lie! It's no. a lie! Then again, they were underage and they were posting bikini photos that set our loins on fire. <sighs> yeah, you should, you should watch those. Then again, they were just having fun. I mean, what else would they wear in a beach? A hazmat suit? A tuxedo. <laughs> also, there is such a thing as invasion of privacy. The school made a decision to not let the students go to their graduation rights to make them an example for the future students. So that they won't do the same thing as the students who got in trouble in the first place. So students, don't wear swimsuits. Be naked instead. Kidding. I'm sure the school has a reason why they weren't allowed to join their graduation rights in the first place. You're right. I mean, if I was a member of the board and over 50 years old, I would do the same thing. As a member of the board, if I was a member of the board, I wouldn't let the people think that these are the kind of students that crawl out of the spawning pool. Zerglings. Which is called the school. But here's the thing, it's a conservative school and the rules haven't changed for decades. Moses. You know what? Each generation is different from the current generation. Things are gonna change in time. I mean, that's the, only, that's the thing in this one. Back in my day, we didn't have Facebook, we had friends there. Testy, testy. <laughs> Glitter text. It took us 10 minutes to download a naked picture of your mother off the web. Yeah, that's right. I made a yo mama joke. <laughs> anyway, bye, bye guys. Bye. Bikini photos are gonna be a common thing as the years go by. Kids are gonna drink at a younger age. Which is wrong. And bad habits will form at a younger age as well. Which is also wrong. You know what they say, the only permanent thing in this world is change. In your face. Hi, I'm Phil and I'm an alcoholic. Hi, Phil. <laughs> So what do you think about this whole student bikini incident? Leave your comments in the comment section below. A word to the wise, do not add your teachers as friends on Facebook. For sure. This is Phil and the rest of the Red Habagat crew, Ozzy and Pidong, yeah. and we're out.